10. Stand by ding. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Roll D. And fed up sound. This is Stand by C in our mind. Roll C. Wipe Q. Stand by 3 with. Dissolve an enemy. Great 2 in the quad and A. Good evening. Roll eight. I'm Tess and Marnie. turn take. A few fi few wildfires have Ready, sparked up today, but nothing too serious Tag. and nothing clean compared deal. to this massive house Stand fire last night in Sky Took. Osage Sky News 6 was over the scene as firefighters worked to get a handle Roll on B. those Wipe. enormous flames. Stand by with. Today we went back out there and found the fire was still burning. The home looks to be Roll destroyed. Enemy white. And you can visit newson6.com to learn how a simple car two breakdown effects. sent two this effects. car up in flames. Enemy take. The extreme fire danger will be next. imminent in green country for at least the next week and a half. We spoke Ready, with an Oklahoma State University fire expert who says it's not the amount of rain that matters so much right now, it's the low humidity and wind Roll speeds. Roll A, take sound. Carl at 10. Snake through the countryside so must be over by two. A fiery we have first of what not to do. Don't burn. Don't Can burn. Uh, wait. Until the, uh, Enemy out. The wind is, Why is uh, for all look dark? Still, the jib's no covering the light. Oh, okay. It's Got been to move the jib. All right. Days for limestone Chris McNamara, 56. Smith that scared me. I thought a lamp went out. Many other rural fire departments in Green Country. Smoke was so thick, sections of Highway 20 west of Skytook had to be shut down Saturday. I'm getting everybody off of this road. Lines of cars were diverted to a new route as a wildfire chewed through fields and eventually took down this home in its path. There's plenty of fuel out there to burn, and then uh, couple that with the uh, systems that have been moving back. in the last uh, week, and then that's expected Ready the next, uh, at least week and a half to continue. OSU key enemy. fire meteorologist J.D. Carlson says the enemy fuel most key. concerning Minute this 43, time of year uh, is dead grass, dead Recommendation will be out to two on the two for the weather chat. And eastern red cedar trees. Carlson says the danger okay, won't the go away until the winds die in. down. The humidity levels increase and a saturating left. rain falls. It could have rained two hours ago, and yet if we get the sun and the low relative humidity, they're, they've dried out you know, a couple hours later, and they're ready to burn. In the meantime, you can protect your home. Carlson suggests keeping the grass 15. cut short around your property. Cut down those eastern red cedar trees and make sure your leaves are raked and put away. Just keep the fuels, you know, low around Here your house. Here we are. For as far out a radius as you can, you know, feasibly do. That would, that would be my main recommendation. Soft Q. We are joining meteorologist mm -hmm. Dick Ferrell now. Sex is and next. Dick, this fire threat, it's not going anywhere Stand anytime by. soon. Not until we get some moisture, and that's not going to happen and anytime soon. Uh, Jenny has some good points there, okay. and we're dealing with the same sort of All right, thing as we go through the, the coming desk. week. This now, will be four and two for the devil. It's not going to be quite as high for, for much of the coming week, and the reason for that is because of cooler temperatures, as you'll see in just a moment. But tomorrow, uh, still going to be a moderate threat. Gusty northerly winds and uh, still very warm temperatures. Speaking of temperatures, notice how warm we will be on Monday. But after that, it's pretty much a roller coaster ride with much cooler weather for mm. Thursday, uh, Tuesday, and especially Excuse Thursday me. into Friday. And those roller coaster temperatures will also be accompanied by some wind. So that's sure, going to be 30, a bit please. of an issue. So please keep that in the back of your mind. Notice how warm we were out in especially the western part of Oklahoma, well into the 70s out there today. Our side of the state generally in the 60s, some 50s for the more eastern counties. And those winds not nearly as strong today as was the case yesterday, but still up around 20, 25 miles an hour. A few gusts to near 30. Uh, right now, the winds have settled down considerably. We're mostly in the lower 50s here in the immediate area. Hominy's right at 50. 50 degrees also down towards Wagoner and down Stand by double. Muskogee. Unfortunately, uh, we'll be with us as we're still looking for some there moisture. We, we do have that roller coaster ride on and Texas dissolve. to talk about. So all that, if you want Ready to see? All right. Thank Ready you. Ready to see? Roll C. Take. Stand by three in effects. Animate dissolve. Ready A with. Police say she robbed a man at Roll A. Knife point, Take then animate. Stole his car. It happened a little more and than an hour be ago full with. at the quick Ready trip B. at 31st and Sheridan. The victim waved down a passing officer and told him what Roll happened. Roll B, sale, take, anime. She runs uh, 23 seconds. Warren Heidi, anime out. At which time we attempted to initiate a vehicle She'll get a mic and then the, the A with. Then took off from us northbound on Sheridan. Stand by her mic. Uh, began a car pursuit. Um, and uh, when we entered the intersection of Admiral and Sheridan, the vehicle attempted to turn left and westbound and struck a parked vehicle or stopped vehicle in the middle of the roadway. My cue. The teenage Somebody girl with? was taken into custody. Fortunately, 
No one we're like hurt. white and can anime. A horseback rider is hit by a truck in the middle anime of Tulsa. We will be out the, the two and a quad. Two and a quad. <coughs> six near 45th and Lewis. For then page it six. gets a little strange. Police tell us a fight broke out and someone threw a sledgehammer through Ready the to? back of the window of the truck that hit the horse. No one was arrested and no one is pressing charges. We're Ready told to? the rider was taken to the hospital in fair condition. Take. An Ready argument with? over money is being blamed on Tulsa's third well, like, homicide this anime. year. Detectives believe Michael Like went to a home near Pine this and next. Highway 75 today to get money he was owed. An argument broke out and police say Like Master, pulled a gun on Deandre four, Simon. Stem of his Officers two. say Simon grabbed a shotgun, then shot and killed Like. Wipe anime. Like has Stem a long criminal three. history. Police say he was being investigated <coughs> for the shooting death of James Parker last Wipe June. Anime. Stem Simon scene. is behind bars for possession of a firearm after a felony conviction. The DA will determine if charges we'll will be filed. Light. Semi tune effects. An Oklahoma icon uh, has passed away. Dissolve. Henry Semi Zero a. was a prominent figure in Tulsa and well known as both a businessman and Rolling. a philanthropist. Zero, Zero Thanks, graduated man. from Central High cool. School and always valued mm, education. To he the quad next. Saved Tulsa Public Schools in 2003 by issuing a million dollar challenge grant during a budget crisis. The Zero International School was named in his honor. And most recently, the new Henry Zero Center for Art and Education in downtown Tulsa. Zero said his wife, Anne, was his biggest influence in helping the less fortunate. Their foundation Great continues to, to support nonprofits across Oklahoma. Zero was 97 when he died Saturday. And take. More than 100 uh, Tulsans are kicking next. off Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Ready holiday jab. a day early with a walk in downtown Start Tulsa. Take. News on Start 6 report with. Tony Russell is here with how the com community is honoring Dr. King. Yes, the walk resembles what civil rights leaders and did out. during the time Ace Dr. King next. fought for racial equality. Ready it's a. the first time the community is coming together after two men pleaded guilty in the infamous Good Friday murder. Raleigh, take some full. What's wrong? Uh, First candy, this, this, this Keisha this Harry at 15. It's a reflection truly of the values of Tulsa. It's a walk of cheer and joy. We can wing that one if we have to. And I think that I'm so grateful Keanu. for those who uh, paved the way. It's Not a bad. walk for a community coming 22 together. 22 for plays, Kian and me. King holiday. Uh, Enemy out. Is, is a Desmond. To reflect back on 29. Gone through and, and the, the no hold here. Oh, wait, this is different. This is different. That he did back when That's he was not alive. Desmond Nugent. All races, uh, all can walks I of life are remembering the life of Dr. Martin Luther out. King. Um, I think it helps to heal the nation as a whole because oh, the date's you know, there. We want okay, to look forward it's at the bottom. It's at 108. Um, first, the next one they need, Steve, is 118. And, and and I think it reminds people that you know the dream still exists. It's just a a beautiful thing to see people of all races and all backgrounds just coming together in unity and celebrate Dr. King's legacy. This walk is also a time for the community to heal. Oops, thanks. Last December, Jake England and Alvin Wait Watts were both sentenced to Can't life in prison no, 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 after no, no, they no, pled no. guilty to the shooting and killing this of black out of victims order. at random One. in North Tulsa. Blow off. Victims are never going to be able to walk in this. The date key uh, was at 108, not 118. Peace, but uh, a community rallied around that, 15. that time. Prosecutor Steve Kunzweiler says today's that just walk was just doomed from the get -go. closing a dark chapter in Tulsa's history. I learned from that there you from go. the uh, case that we did okay. with Mr. Watson. All right, here we are. Was. Stand by uh, the character of a three. community down the line. Uh, was definitely stronger than the prejudice of individuals. Stop Q. And one of the largest Ready NLK parades Take. in the country is Ready here three. in Tulsa tomorrow at 11 o'clock. And we can give you more information, especially the maps, where the Take. parade route starts. That's Four all on Yeah, we'll want to know four. that. And Lori Fulbright and Ivana Johnson will both be in that parade tomorrow. So it's going to be a fun celebration. Ready for Thank you, Tony. Tag. There's Music. A lot Start of ways pool. To no. Roll out. Solve it. Home scholarship. But now Stand there's an online site targeting Oklahoma students to make them Robbie. sugar Anime babies. White. Plus, a community comes together after Show a soldier's break. memorial is vandalized. Fade this, Ray Break. All right. <clears throat> Ten seconds. Stand my tuna quad with. Three, two, one. And better Q and Ken Anime. A unique dating website is targeting Anime college now. students hey, right here in next. Oklahoma. Seekingarrangement.com matches young single clean, women with rather. sugar daddies with who pay cash for dates. 
But Evan Anderson tells us the site is also advertising itself as an easy way to pay for tuition. Roll eight, take sound. The solution to all of Christian your problems <laughs> has arrived. Seekingarrangement.com okay. is rolling out ads and promotions <coughs> marketed towards college students. According to the website, college students make up 42% of what it calls its sugar baby membership. Now they're looking for alternative sources, and we happen to be one of those sources. 84 OU students joined the Sugar Daddy website in 2013 to help soak up the cost of a college education. A total of 150 are registered and actively seeking financial aid from wealthy benefactors. We've kind of been slowly targeting them more and more to let them know about this alternative financial aid, really, if you, if you will. The first thing I thought was, this is online sex trade. A women's rights advocate Kristen Davis says this the is king. a form of prostitution. They are sleeping with the men and Can't they get I mean. the money in return and they don't look at it as know. anything more than a Bridget. monetary transaction. The website yeah. creators admit eventually sex probably will be involved. However, Ready it's king. not a requirement. That would be illegal. They try Can't to I mean. make it seem like it's just companionship, but I mean, you know they want more in return. It's your last key, minute 22, um, standard down, season next pitch 14. Yeah, definitely for that much money. But I mean, I guess, you know, if times get desperate, so, you know, you Step don't take student loans, but yeah, I right. personally wouldn't do it. Evan Anderson, News Roll on C. 6 tonight. Wipe Q. Why did she An say? Stand by 4. Is vandalized on Zom. The Someone front. said News 6 it tonight. It was a simple Red memorial a to a special er, we'll soldier. Key. And now a Bethany neighborhood Thanks, is in shock Roll and angry. Take. Staff Sergeant Jack Martin received a bronze key star and a purple heart, among other accolades, prior and to key being killed in the line of duty in 2009. His mom proudly be displays all with of his seconds. awards and put up a simple memorial Ready in the yard as a reminder of her son's ultimate sacrifice. The flag was the center of the memorial until someone stole it. As word spread through the neighborhood about the theft, neighbors jumped into action, gathering outside the Martin's house to raise a new flag. Robbie sound and take in the enemy. It's a show of force to show that we do care. Anyway, else, that we Mike. are willing to do what we need to. Mike you. Right, four for Martin's tees. neighbors have decided to start a neighborhood watch to keep a close eye on the memorial. Take a little music, stand by T3 nice or 5, does all anime. Green country on the Whatever you got, John, stand by your break. Network, but our winter warm-up is coming to an end. Dick Ferro is tracking temperatures in the teens when we return. Pay this, right, break. 30 heavy, oh my gosh. All right, 10 seconds, stand by one with. And four, three, two, one, and Pedro Kuhn, anime. Well, we've got a real roller coaster ride ahead of us during the coming week. Uh, the last couple of days, very much warmer than normal. As you can see, we topped out at 65. Folks off to the east were in the upper 50s. For the west, you go a little warmer yet. And as mentioned earlier, they were in the 70s out across western Oklahoma. So it's been another one of those days. Now, what's going to happen tonight uh, is another weak boundary is going to move through. It's going to shift our winds around from southerly for the most okay, part during the sorry. overnight hours to northerly towards morning. Winds will be much lighter. And with the fair skies and the lighter winds, we should be around the freezing mark, which is still a relatively mild start to our Monday. And notice the arrows are starting to pick up a bit, but notice they're pointing to the south. That means a rather brisk north wind for much of the day. That means the fire danger is still going to be a concern. But temperatures won't be quite as warm. They're really cold air and won't be arriving until tomorrow night. So we'll still be well into the 50s. In fact, some folks will be in the low 60s for tomorrow. So another one more really nice warm day, at least in that sense. Now, here's what we have at the present time. So folks are right around the, well, most of us are in the upper 40s or low 50s. We're at 52 in Tulsa, it's 45 though in Bartlesville, Muskogee at 50 degrees, Stigler 51, Okmulgee 50. So we're kind of hanging sure, out two minutes, please, two minutes. degree mark with a very light southerly breeze. Fair skies out there you can see from Tulsa, 52 with a dew point of 23, but that south wind still blowing around 10 to 15. It'll continue to settle down. Those go through the overnight hours and that weak boundary moves in. And here's how temperature should be by early morning. Most of us again in the 30s. Notice the absence of any cloud cover as we look at this uh, solution. Noontime hour should be back up around 50 or the low 50s, okay. so a nice warm up again tomorrow despite a north wind. And then as we go through the day tomorrow, well into the 50s, dropping down to the low 50s again by tomorrow evening. Notice what happens though as we get into the day on Tuesday. We'll be in the low 20s to start the day, <laughs> 30 by the noon hour. 
And we're going to struggle to get above free um, for Tuesday afternoon. So it's an addition on page 62, um, the play to percentage tends to vote will run out of this too. Of any cloud care, which oh, also crap. No, we can't do that. Moisture coming our way. Crap. We have travel plans. Obviously not much going on. As you yep. can see from the bigger You're picture, right. all the active weather way Show off. Show one minute, please. One minute. So You're right. Coast, it's going to have to be this one. This next boundary is when they're really colder. I'll be arriving as we go into the day Tuesday. Yep, that's the only way that's going to work. Light snow, some brief flurries, maybe across Get that, John. Arkansas. Page 62. To get to us. And There's going to be a full screen at the end. It's going to be come out of biz one. Thursday, Friday time frame. We still don't have any moisture coming our way. Now there will be a system that could produce some rain along the Gulf That's Coast, the only way we can do South it. Texas, Louisiana, those areas, right, come on for perhaps come on, the Rockies come on. and up around the Great Lakes. But for the Show them 30 part, seconds, please. Like a dry forecast for us, and as we extend it further on, are they out both out there, guys? The January also dry. Just Temperature jump. should be on the on the uh, cool side of things 30 as show. well. Course. So here's how things will be going for us. We'll be around 15, 15 please. tomorrow afternoon. A whole lot colder on Tuesday. Starts to moderate I guess we can show you on 20. If it's not cold enough for you on Tuesday, look what we have for Thursday into Friday. Colder yet. 20. Uh, 20. Come on, come on. 15 show. Surge, a very cold air moving our way. But this is going to be close. Dean's coming out. Long. Stand by three. Dissolve. Sunday, Music. No Start to move. Jib. And dissolve. Right, Rossi. No and right, stand by. Nice. Stand by your break. Three, two, one. Fade it. Roll your break. Very nicely done, guys. All right, Oklahoma hey, City, we're on time. All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Stand by A. 3, 2, 1. Roll A. Fade up sound. The Thunder Music. have been riding Kevin Durant's hot shooting so much lately, it's left opposing teams muttering This round's 45 no, 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 seconds. No, no, Here shot. comes the Blitz. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be up to we'll the K2. Conquest of the Kings. The Cowboys' second half and then rally the four with. came up just short. Master Watch hitting on four, please. Preset two. Matchup of Kansas. Quite a punch we took. Master Watch hitting on the two as well. Okay. Of road games, hanging on in Waco we might center up a little bit on Dean there on two. We'll break down what's working for Lon Kruger's squad. Fifteen. All that plus the NCAA changes course. Stand by the K2. OSU and TU football change some staff. The Super Bowl matchup is set. Sunday open, John. And the come off Here we are. Stand by. For another win and play the percentages. I really don't, don't comprehend that. Here comes the blitz. Roll it and fade up sound. Stand by for wind. This is the Oklahoma Ford Sports Blitz with Dean Levins and John and Holcomb. Kim and Kim and I'm John Holcomb. It's not that OSU fans and players haven't wanted to beat Kansas every time they've awesome. matched up in basketball, but what two was under next. a congenial rivalry is now edgy. Last year's upset of KU in Lawrence and then the hotly contested rematch in Stillwater, the catalyst for that change. And on Saturday, the handful of technical and flagrant fouls combined with a lot of trash talk seemed to escalate things. Ready, two under. Post-game handshake line, not all seashells and balloons either. By the way, <laughs> March 1st in Stillwater. That's the next time they get together. Take you. Read. I'm Dean Blevins. A lot of great memories driving to Tulsa tonight. We're, we're next. doing our first blitz in some 12 plus years. Calling Nolan Richardson basketball games, Don Morton, George Henshaw, TU football. It was the Tulsa Roughnecks doing sports scene on TV with my good friend Bill Land, introducing the state to Hookie the Bull. Ready, Jim. Reading Sal and Sittler and Bill Connors. Lots of golf with Will Richardson moving down the turnpike a few months before Billy Tub Sooners were taken down by Larry Brown in Kansas in the title game and meeting four year old Such a move. Johnny Hope. Take. Look at old day. Stand by three with. <laughs> A little older than four. Yeah, but, you may have been a little thanks, older than And it's all, man. Can you animate their names? Busy week for the Thunder, punctuated by Kevin Durant's offense and explosion on Friday. A with the on next. The Sacramento Kings in town. Well, and uh, KD getting some offensive Ready, help a. lately from Serge Ibaka. Back-to-back -back games board. of at least 20 points coming in tonight. Roll eight. Take. Can Kings have never won in Oklahoma City. Start with the now. All right, three hits at the B-plus. Lower third, the B-sound full. And gets the layup and foul. Thunder down two early. Second quarter, off a steal. KD lobs to Surge. Thunder up, going into the half. Ibaka with 20. Third quarter, Thunder pull away. KD penetrate kick out to Reggie Jackson. Hits the three, Thunder up 11. Ready key. And KD puts the game on ice with a pull up three. Kid out of me, step by B full sound. He didn't play a whole lot. Didn't play into the fourth. He had 30 points. They win their third straight, 108, 93. Roll B, wipe sound. Ready key, Can out of me. And as we all know, Enemy now. K K this runs 18 a about the player. team up to C next, page um, 45. Some nights he's going to have a, a stand a by C and Charlie's mic. 
I just like I just like the way he thinks. He thinks about we'll the We'll see. And wipe Q. Stem like three As with. Always, plenty of topics to sound off. Dissolve. On okay. No name here. Ready biz two. That's all right. Race. Big win for the Sooners on the road. OSU's epic comeback falls just and short. Take an anime. Just to name a few. If you like to talk or about don't. any of these topics or something <laughs> oh, else. Oh, okay. There is an anime. All right. Questions or comments breaks to next, folks. To vote on play the percentages, text Stand Dean by your breaks. 79640. Also, jump into our Twitter conversations with the hashtag OFSB. College basketball breakdowns are next. And music full and roll your breaks, everyone. And fade. Very nicely done, folks. We'll be up to C for OSU, then up to three with page 47 and five, four, three, two, one, and we'll see, and up on it, Q. It was a tail Stand by three with, and a zombie in Canada. Saturday, down 19 with a shot to win it. That doesn't happen and often no. against Kansas a clean. in Allen Fieldhouse. No, and Kansas, Dean, is a very talented Ready team. Ready, A. Joel Embiid is improving rapidly. It's scary to think how much better He'll become the seven-foot freshman. Could be the number one draft number pick. One pick. But yeah. Cowboys exploited a Jayhawk weakness and combined that with getting red hot from three and almost came all the way back. Now, Rolling. the problems Take. early, a lack of aggressiveness Head offensively. Coach. Embiid's BB presence on in the lane had something to do with that. He ended up with eight block shots. Run this for a didn't while. make Kansas work hard enough on defense to take advantage of opportunities. Kansas turned quick shots and then Cope turned over the momentum <laughs> plays. The slam on the break and okay. really into it. Cool. At the end of this play, too, a lack of composure hurt OSU. Markel Brown gets Is into it, it with Jamari Trailer. For this? Brown, yeah, the only like scholarship it. senior, couldn't stand down. First of two technical fouls in the afternoon. Tree, uh, trailer also teed up. Cowboys didn't catch any first half breaks either. Obvious goaltend on Embiid right here. Goes up through the rim. It was missed. The ill will continued later after Marcus Smart fouled hard going to the rim. Wayne Selden, watch him come over and just kind of stand B. over Smart. That's not cool. Stevie Clark is teed up for shoving Selden out of the way. You can hardly blame him, though. And really, Selden gets nothing but a personal foul on that play. In the second half, Cowboys were bearing down on KU. Collision there between Embiid and Brown, and Markell is called for the foul, his fourth, then says something that earns Roll another tee. That's his fifth, and he's out White. with four minutes left. Okay. Now about that Kansas weakness, the ball handling. They turned full over width. a lot. OSU's 2-2-1, three-quarter towards zone pressure for mistake after mistake, and the Cowboys started finding the range. Martel Brown, Phil Forte, draining threes. OSU helped make Andrew Wiggins a non-factor. He wouldn't get over the top of screens, wouldn't challenge shooters to stay close to Brown outside. Stemme and with Forte for just kept hitting huge threes. Good execution off the inbounds play with seconds to go. This makes it a one-point game. On the last play here, you know, I don't have a problem with Nash. He gets the ball on the scramble from Smart off the miss. I don't have a problem with Nash taking a shot instead of a cross-court pass over a KU defender a. to Stevie Clark. Not enough time. Mason made a clean strip. Chirps at the OSU bench afterwards. About 10 Cowboys left forcing field. the Jayhawks to hang on for dear life. Roll A, white sound. And Ken Anime. Coming all the way back and clawing and, you know, cutting it down to. Anime now. It's friends to, uh, 12. C's next. Page 48. And, uh, having a chance Stand by C. It's, it's, that's a moral victory for us. And, you know, uh, and like I said, we just should have played like that for the uh, tip off. White Q. Two in effects. To start the Big 12 schedule. Two in effects is nice. As soon as escape Ray, two in effects. Record in a five game I know. The Big 12, including it's yesterday. Like. It's all of an enemy. Well, the first over a team ranked in the top 12 or higher since hey, 93. And after being ranked for the first time in four years, a missed opportunity in Manhattan yeah, yeah. Yes, correct. was yeah. followed by really clutch play. And despite John missing introduced three, it three free throws in the final 18 already, seconds, with. OU hung tough to upset Baylor in Waco. Wouldn't have done it, though, without center Ryan Spangler, a high school quarterback might be undersized at center, but plays with an oversized heart and a lot of savvy. Enemy. The Gonzaga transfer out of Bridge Creek High School plays with a fierce competitive now. fire and this toughness. Two. 6 6-7, avoiding foul trouble is what he says is this helping three. cut loose, especially in the last three. three Big 12 games. This is the one Sooners way to change one two yep. top 12 teams. Yesterday, two impressive blocks came against a big, big Baylor White. front line. Check out the numbers. And All right. Gone from a with our A clean reveal. Points and four rebounds against Texas and Kansas to Stand by A. And 12.7 rebounds while shooting 71% oh, yeah, this was in the, the field I just and 83% what the said. in the last three league Rolling. games from the what? line. Yesterday, OU continued its poor shooting. Okay. Only one of 12 from distance. On this for a while, we'll be up to be some full with. Defense focused on the perimeter. Plenty of VO here. The long about Kruger 38 left. Ball movement and working inside out. But he healed and Cam Clark heated up three consecutive threes. Gave mm. OU confidence and the lead. Part of a 16-0 run. Healed and Clark were just six of 25. You know who's going to answer the question first on the uh, viewer question? He'll make okay. seven of his last 10 and scoring all of his 19 points after intermission. 
Clark's mid-range game has returned and he played a key role in that game and was able to move around and get a few Propter. open looks. A questionable call a little bit later hurt them, but that comes following this good jumper by Cam Clark. A play late in the game with Woodard goes the other way and Oklahoma almost She's talking about Woodard for it because Woodard missed three of five free throws down the stretch, but it was a coaching mismatch. There you go. There you go. Cougars defensive play at the end helped them. The biggest play to save the game. There you go. To Baylor looked to spring seven. Stand by B. Sumpful with. Who's made one of three coming into the game for a three or a two game tying two and nine seconds left. Cameron I think Clark he skipped through some of it. I'm not sure. Austin. Wasted time. Shot attempt too late. Roby wipes out. And Kian Animate. I'm being confident means I need to make I don't know. I we were lost to Animate out. Got another key at nine. It's 21 seconds. Sees next for page 49. For Ready key. Yeah, it's way back two and three. Uh, you don't want to be there. Animate out. Stand by C but, uh, and John's mic. Spot, you know, we've been close the last two or three games that we've let go. And uh, we finally finished it. And I think that the top. Roll C and wipe Q. Stand by A with. Roll A, wipe and Animate. Boy, T, you watched an eight-point lead disappear in the last minute. Animate out. Be helpful with us next. Remember, the full screen on these next two pages Shaq are dead. Person, Ray, Stand by B. Highs. But here's something you should really respect. Tulsa rebounds Saturday at Marshall, trailing by as many as eight in the second half. T, you would outscore the herd. Stand by B. 29-12 in the last 11 minutes to pick up their first road win of the season. 69. Roll B. Wipes out. Can't animate. Oh. We had more shots John. Animate. 15. A bit more uh, C's and, next. Uh, page 15. I don't know my help cue. Uh, Stand by C. The Marshall team is, in my opinion, one of the most dangerous teams in our league. This is definitely a very good road win. Roll C. And wipe Q. Back home for two this week. Stand by with. It's not every day the NCAA Roll has a, a wipe change and of animate. heart, but thanks to an NCAA waiver, the Golden Eagles were able to play their two road games. Remember, we thought they were going to have to forfeit them. Four in effects next. They won both page of them. 51. Sean Glover had 25 to lead ORU over Abilene Christian Thursday night. 82 Ready, four in effects. Ten different effects. players scoring for the Eagles in the second half. Glover with 1.2 seconds Get left the hits the jumper for ORU over Incarnate Word 79-77 on Saturday. Anime take. The 11th ranked Cowboys continue to roll. OSU now 16 oh, and one on the season. Ready, a -whip. Tied atop the Big 12 standings with Roll West Virginia. Take anime. Oklahoma State riding a four game winning streak after beating Texas Tech. And I mean, no. Two in effects. Brittany Martin led the way. Two in effects, page 52. In what turned into a rout in the second half. Lieberman Award watch list candidate Tiffany Bias added nine. Big week ahead for OSU. They Ready, two in effects. Kansas on Wednesday. Kansas Get the other two. Then seventh ranked Baylor comes to Gallagher Iba Arena next Sunday. Anime take you. Oh, you women dug themselves too deep a hole Saturday Relay. in take. Morgantown Can't down me. 17. Oh, you ran out of gas. Anime out. Despite the fact that Aaron Ellenberg okay. chipped in what 28. Was that about? Three next. 53 with 11 minutes oh, to wait play. A minute. Missed 17 of the next 20. Oh yeah, shots. we're up to seed in three on the two. The 10 West Virginia. Thank you, John. Ready. Stand by C. Points, it's not my script. 63, dropping to 11 and seven, two and three in the Big 12. It's the first two three starts since Roll 1998. C. White. As we showed you earlier, the Thunder took care of Sacramento 108-93 tonight. OKC what is that? now eight and five without Russell Westbrook. And just when you okay. think you can't get it, much better, there's it's Kevin not Durant right. I don't know what it is. Level. We'll there's just go be able clean for a there. second until we he get it. All right, ready eight with then. Friday, but but Dean, something else stood out. You know, he's actually raised his level in yeah. all areas, and that's one of the many things that makes him just one in a gazillion yeah, type we'll player. Defense, passing, Thank you. rebounding, ready you know, clean, more pounds. The John's one thing go that has improved question. exponentially, though, that I think helps. is his ball handling. Turnovers are down, assists are up. Ball rarely slips from his palm on the dribble. And although it's a naturally B, B, high clean. dribble at 6'10", his vision is great. Anticipation, he, he knows he must set teammates up, really, with easy looks because without Russell scoring is often the Step challenge for a lot of his mates. His handle, though, is no longer a problem. Look at him handle this rock. Hmm. It's really fun to watch, John. Durant, extraordinary and only getting better. Roby, White. Keep reading. Keep reading. Somebody. And not all is perfect in Thunderland. What's going on there? One guy Ace full width is hurt. next. We'll show you that. His offensive game, he makes the easy look hard. Good guy, bad hands, great team toughness, terrible for anything on offense. Living a place for Perk. And winner at the Thunder, cut his minutes or ultimately deal him as a serious matter. Reggie Jackson scoring Stemme with term, He's turning the ball over a little bit. Being a reluctant passer to KD is a serious issue, but He's been good enough, and a consistent Serge Ibaka is needed. Big night tonight. Yeah, we're, we're still along. I don't know what's going still on. Still young with a high ceiling. Serge with the 20 we talked about earlier. First time he's ever had three straight 20-plus games. Good win tonight, though. 
Still waiting on Russell Westbrook to pass all the tests on his need to return. Roll your wipe sound. You know, we were talking Can't a little wait. bit on defense what? tonight. We were talking. He just read the anime down. Viz 2. Yeah, he so started yeah, reading. That's what we don't need to do because. Stand by Viz 2. He's run 16. Big scoring nights all the time. So you got to rely on your defense. And I think uh, if we do that, then we'll be fine. Wipe Q. And Russ still waiting to see when he will be back. Clark three on a two next, page 54. Be after the All-Star break, three. which is February the 16th. That's four more weeks. And KD's left hand is bruised from a wicked fall Ready three. eight days ago. Take. College football, when things don't go well, a -West. and they didn't this past season at TU, changes are usually made. Ready Bill Blankenship is shaking, shaking up the coaching staff a little bit, John. Yeah, and he's bringing in a couple of familiar names as far as TU Rally. football Take. is concerned. Can't Earlier this week, offensive coordinator Greg Peterson was let go. Enemy now, be clean. Teams. He was also the wide receivers coach. Stand TU by struggled B. offensively during a 3-9 and nine season, of course, after winning from USA Fly. in 2012. Blankenship had a hand in play call. All right, out the tune effects next, page 55. Peterson's replacement. But he does have a new quarterbacks coach, making it official tonight that his son, Ready to Josh, effects. a former TU signal Dean caller, and most recently the head coach at Muskogee High School, Get will rejoin two. his father. Ready to effects. Former TU receiver Dan Bitson is the new wide receivers coach, according to a report from Inside Tulsa Sports. Yeah, I'm take you. Bitson. Sooners had a major recruiting weekend with some of the okay, nation's top high schoolers in the Army. Okay, kind of a lengthy reading right now. We'll go to the next. one player has committed, but word is several more are leaning heavily toward the Sooners who have picked up some major steam following the OSU and the Alabama wins. The, them getting commitments from the nation's number one player, you know, number one all-purpose back, really, and Joe Mixon was pretty big for them. The commit is a former commit to Northwestern, the guy that did Ready commit to East Jordan Thomas, a safety out of Klein, Texas, rated the 37th best player in Texas. Matt Edition gives OU four defensive backs for the class, but he's not the one Rolling. who has its eyes Take. on. People in Tulsa know Stephen Parker of Jeans is surprised. The Sooners won along with A&M and others. The Sooners feel good about the athletic Ready number one player in the state. But Parker plans to take it to signing day when anything can happen. DeAndre Clark of Douglas, state's number two player and defensive lineman, is looked at the same way by the Sooners. Anime take you. As always, hey, Mike Gundy goes about replacing offensive line coach Joe Wickline. Ready, He's now in Texas. The Cowboys will also be looking for a new go-to receiver as Josh Stewart looks to improve his draft Roll stock line. during workouts. Take anime. Many of those workouts have been taking place in Frisco, Texas, Anime. just north of Dallas. Be of course, with. Stewart was a dangerous slot receiver at OSU, and those types of players have found homes on NFL rosters the last Stand few by years. Stand by B. Stewart has been projected to go anywhere between the fourth and seventh rounds of the draft, and there are plenty who believe Stewart should have come back for his final year in Stewart. Roll B, wipe sound, and can't animate. Everybody's Stewart's different. 15 seconds. You know, at the end of the day, I take those up. Animate out, but up to the jib I next. I do what I think is best for this me. This is a 15. Decision I Five made, out, stand by the jib. This is just what I wanted to do, and I'm having fun doing it. I don't regret, regret and taking this chance one bit. Touch your move, take Q. Championship Semi Sunday three. in the NFL features the battle between Tom Brady and with. Peyton Manning. Patriots up back with this, what the backers for? Well, and Denver Ready had a. the home field advantage. Brady with a 10-4 edge in the previous Roll showdown with anime. Manning, but boy, he couldn't get anybody open. <laughs> Pick it up in the third quarter. Broncos up 13. Lower third Manning score. It's a B. Thomas for the three-yard touchdown, 20 to three, Denver. But here comes New England. Ready Brady key. keeps it himself. Two-point conversion was a critical play. It was no good, so the Pats were down 10. Denver would seal it with Devontae Ball. Can't enemy. He converts Step on third and two. Manning throws for 400 yards. Broncos win it. Roll B. 26-16. NFC title key. game, and 49ers enemy. at Seattle. That loud place up north west, out. third quarter. Colin Arthur scored the C. Finds Anquan Bolden in the end zone. 26-yard touchdown. John will go first on the viewer question. Fourth quarter, things get crazy. Russell Wilson on fourth down goes for the end zone. Jermaine Curtis Ready catches key. it. Seattle up 2017. Under 30 seconds. 49ers trying to tie in the red zone. Kaepernick throws into double coverage. Key Intercepted. Stand by C. Richard and Sherman, Charlie Seahawks Mike. face the Broncos in New York. They win 23-17. Roll C. Wipe Q, Charlie. Stand by three at the B-Blast. With, with Dissolve and Enemy. Ready to text your vote in for playing the percentages in a little bit. Now time for a viewer question. Take and Enemy, if there's Mark anything. Force next on Charlie. On, uh, know, Dan, John. Who do you guys think will win the Super Bowl? You have two choices, Denver or Seattle. Gentlemen, and take you. I'll take a stab at this okay. one first. Get three I, back over I there. I like Peyton Manning, uh, but I've, I've kind of been partial to him all along. Nice job, Ready three. As long as it's not 20 ready? below and he's got gloves on both hands, I think and Denver's going to be able to win the game. Seattle's got terrific defense, ready but uh, people found a new reason to dislike ready Richard four. Sherman in his post-game on-field uh, interview. Ready well, to, I'm pretty here. close with you Take there. Two. I'm uh, big with uh, there Manning, and we'll, we'll go that direction, ready although three. there is such good defense 
in Seattle that if this game were in Seattle, I, I think we know who we, who we would both take. But uh, up in New York, who knows what the weather will be. If it is really cold, we'll be going Brady, to break Manning out there at the three shot. But, uh, three shot. My Ray money would three. be on that. Take three. I just want to see four. snow plows Take. instead of limos being stopped out there where you can't <laughs> park anywhere close by. Take. All right, uh, Stand we by will uh, give you Stand more everyone. of our opinions coming up because we have to play the percentages, and that's after the break. And roll your brakes and fade us down. All right. Hey, 10 seconds. Or CS1, that's what I meant, John. <laughs> Stand by A with. Okay, so you get to use it tonight in four, three, two, one. Roll A and Fade of Q and Ken Enemy. Packed house Somebody. as usual at the fairgrounds <laughs> in Tulsa for this year's Anime. Chili Bowl. NASCAR driver Ricky Stenhouse is with escorted by next. girlfriend Danica Patrick and Casey Kane competed but did not win. Four-time champion Kevin yeah, Swindell so you'll probably have to was them, second uh, going into the last lap. Stand by B with for sound. the final turn, allowing Brian Clawson to win comfortably and take home the golden Roll B, wipe sound and Ken Enemy. How are you doing on time, okay? Good. Enemy out. Another key at 11. This runs 20. C's next for play to percentages. Had to come from as far back as he did, and we'll take a little luck here at the Chili Bowl. And key in, Enemy. You know, as soon as that heat race happened, and then put us behind that. Enemy out. Send my C, then the one at the wall. I guess enough to battle back through here, and we'll come back next year and try to start. Roll C and wipe Q, Charlie. All right, so gentlemen, want time to play those percentages. So we start, of course, with Dean Blevins, the defending champion. Cowboys came up just short at Kansas yesterday. Percentage chance OSU wins the rematch when the Beakers Take come to still two. When who does? Take two. The Beakers. <laughs> okay. Uh, four I'll tell you what, I'm, a, I'm a Bill Self fan and I'm a Kansas basketball fan. Ready for? Uh, not in this case. I think that uh, OSU is not going to get behind by 19 points. And there was a lot of stuff going on there, as, as John told you, and as I listened to on the radio. For the uh, OSU block. will have a lot okay. of reason to play. I, I sense an atmosphere like the Sutton era when the defenses were really charged. I think that's what I know. we will see. I love it. March the first. Good selection, Jeff. percent OSU wins. Great for it. Take. As a matter of consistency, and I know I'm going to get attacked in studio on this, but I did the NP last uh, week when the question came up. Triples next. They would win in Lawrence. I guess. I'm going to go with an NP on this one, too. <laughs> I'm staying consistent. <clears throat> Uh, well, good. But, I hope you but I, uh, let me just say this: <laughs> I can't wait for March first. All Take. right, Sally. Oh, you. I don't know who <laughs> we're going two to games next. This so. week, Bedlam basketball week yeah, from two Monday. Probably not going to pick that one either. But <laughs> OU you with two games this week: TCU Wednesday at Texas Tech Saturday. John, percentage chance Ready they win four? both of them. Take seventy-five percent. Uh, like them and big we'll go time. Next, and then we'll go to the Tech wall next. Beating Baylor in box. Lubbock. Tech's doing some good things under Tubby Smith, Great but two. I still think the Sooners will pull that one out. John, Take. nothing's a given, but uh, TCU and one Norman, next. Oklahoma should handle them. You're right, though, on Tech. You got first up, so uh, I'm along. I'm with Ready you there. One. I say 67 percent, two out of three. Take. Gene, you called Kevin Durant a one in a gazillion. Oh, we're gonna I just uh, the phrase earlier. Uh, no percentage trouble this chance time. He wins the NBA MVP. I think it's two. The gazillion, just Deep percentage. Thing. Well, Take. I'm afraid that the Thunder Four has to. Next. Probably win the West for him to win that, um, and I think the Thunder has Remember a really the good chance of that. But I, to be honest with it, I'm saying 48 percent. I think four. this is the year he has really cut that gap. LeBron will have a push at the end. Right now, KD is the best player. Maybe when it's all over, but I think when it's all said and done, he's still a little behind at 48 percent. Yeah, I, I'll say right around there. I say 40 percent. If you picked it right now, he'd be the guy Back right now. But unfortunately, you got to play. Which a one's few the BO for that? To happen, okay. but they need more games. I mean, is there another one after this? To help it. Huh? Okay. Take. All right. Texas football coach Charlie <laughs> Strong said the party is over in Bevo land. Everybody's got to move back into those athletic dorms on campus. No more off campus parties. So, John, percentage Great of four. Texas recruits, the Longhorns lose because the party's over. Take. Well, you know, there's a lot of guys that try to get next. down there. I'll say 10%. Take. Q. None, not a factor. <laughs> Ready uh, one and an rules, A. All that stuff didn't mean anything. I, although I don't think Mac Brown took it very night, very uh, well. Uh, but zero. He's not going to lose anybody because of Ready the one. Move. Take not a factor. Stand by a. a video clue. Roll Let's a. take a look at Stop. this. This is Chuck Fisher shooting up <laughs> out the, to the triple goal next. With the Oklahoma City Bears. Out to the there triple. There he is on the ice. Stand Taking by the triple. Slap shots. Here comes one that's going to hit him right in the dome. Percentage chance you could stop a slap shot from a minor league hockey player. And Zav, ready for? Uh, well, I'll, I'll go ahead and say five. Two's next uh, and a triple. I might get lucky. By, ready you know, two. I, as long as I got something protecting the head, it might come off my dome and then it wouldn't get in the net. Pick right? two. Uh, I will say All right, ready to triple. Because I've been beaten by John. And so, uh, I <laughs> take, stand by this one. What? All right, and we got to go. Dissolve. Stand by your bricks, everyone. Oh, Dean or John, 7 9 Not 6 the Back with the yeah. results no. after this. Yeah. No. And fade this. Roll your brakes, everyone. Got early. Sorry, guys. 
All right, 10 seconds. We'll be up to three, then the biz two, and we'll see how much time we have left here. Let's go in four, three, two, one, and fade up Kim. Stand by uh, this too. The voting was quite close tonight. And no way. No way. Dissolve an enemy. Well, I mean, look John, at that. John oh, three wow. to the gym. John only answered four. I kind of feel like what OSU might have. <laughs> Twenty <felt> seconds. Like. <laughs> Evan Lawrence. Oh. 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 We don't have a Stand trophy, by three. Dissolve. Soccer. Stand by the gym. Fifteen. Put it on. Stand by the gym. Put it on. Put it on. Okay. Start your move and <laughs> dissolve. Run your copy. Stand by your brakes, folks. Five, four, three. Two, one, fade it, row your break, guys. Very nicely done, guys. Very good job. Very good job All right. Uh